Matter of fact, let's talk about some of the good. Let's talk about the good because everybody always talk about the seeds. I've no, I mean, come on, man. He been he been gone fifteen years. Yes, and I'm still getting money with him. Yes, and he was gone. He was only here a year and eleven months. Yes, yes, and he got a hell of a lot shit done in a year and eleven months. I mean, goddamn, see, at least three songs a day. When did he sleep zero? <laughs> I don't know, bro. Cause. That's why I said it might have been some shit I wouldn't know. Yeah, I wouldn't man. Know. Maybe I he was sick or something. You know, C used to get sick. He did. He, he stayed used to get with sick. Cold, yeah, he stayed know? with them colds, man. So maybe he was feeling bad. Yeah. It's the only thing I could see. Other than that, he was up at that time man, of night. He working, bro. 10 o'clock? Hey. 11 o'clock? Man, it's prime time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, nigga, it's time to turn up. Mm-hmm. It's time to work. Yes. <laughs> yes. He wide awake at that time. Time to work. I mean, come on. How many times did he call you after one o'clock in the morning? Call me later than that. Exactly. Two o'clock, three man, o'clock. Let's go. Hey, yeah. man, I'm on the way to Houston, man. Come to the condo. We finna work. That's him. I'm on the way to Houston, man. I'll be there in about an hour. Mm. <laughs> was you in uh was you uh in the entourage that came by my house in Lancaster when y'all left the you remember he had, he he had did a show and I think uh Colleen he caught a private plane to Dallas to do a, a show in Fort Worth. Somebody was driving the Bentley. He got in the Bentley, and then he came to my house to pick up all this money I had collected for him. Was you in that entourage? I might have been and just didn't know what was going on. Yeah. Because I think that's the night we did. We performed grind hard with him. He made us perform with him that night. in Fort Worth, right? It was a small spot in yes, Fort Worth. Yes, I didn't yeah. get to make it to that show. Yeah. And then I had all. They just popped up on the internet. Matter of fact, he's a Leo. He's a shout out. He's a shout he's out. He's a, uh, he put that up on his channel not too long ago. Already. Already. He got some good good content on that yeah, channel, do. man. Yeah, he do. Shout out to his Leo, man. And anybody want to see some good Pimp C stories, y'all make sure y'all check out that man For platform. For sure, I owe you a Pimp C story, man. Yeah, yeah, since I'm popped outside, I've been telling you, hey, man, I'm finna give you a trill story, man. He gonna get mad. Hey, man. God damn it. He gonna get mad when he see you on here. Yeah! <laughs> nah, he doing that that voice. <laughs> nah, that's, 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 that's his Leo little. voice. That's he's a Leo and Leo. Yeah, yeah, do it again. Yeah, y'all. <laughs> that nigga crunk with that shit. Yeah, man. Mr. Trill, what is that? Trill Gear. Trill Gear. Yeah, man. Y'all, y'all support that man. That yeah, man trying to get some shit going, man. man. Man, everybody, man, we all dealt with some shit, bro. That shit was a huge blow to the whole clique. So everybody dealt with it differently. That's because it was unbelievable. Still. That's one of them situations that you feel like it'll never. You see it happen to everybody else. You know what I'm saying? You'll never see it happen to. I was like, damn, how can that nigga be dead? <sighs> Out of all people, and I and, and I bet you that's how the people around Takeoff is feeling right now too. Right? How can that happen to him? You know what I mean? At, it's, right at that point. At that. Oh. Man, C had a cartoon he was finna do. Man. Called Pimp Stick. Where we were all using our voices for the voices yes. and all of that. This is adult swim type shit. Yes. That's why he was in LA. That's why he was moving to LA. Yes. We had a lot of work in LA. We had music we did with Snoop in LA. Unreleased songs, yes. XM yes. Radio already solidified. I already doing it. So yes. I can just imagine how he would be thriving in the game right now and whatever he would have been doing because he was getting away from rap. He wanted to produce and do more films and shit like mm-hmm. that. Mm. He was pretty much tired of hip hop. Every time yeah. the boys talking about, I'm trying to, I'm gonna retire and go to Hawaii on you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was like, it's, get away from you, folks. Yes. Hey, it's your girl Jazzy K from Super Tight TV. We want to thank everyone who's been watching and subscribing. And if you enjoy this content, please hit the notification bell so you can be notified every time we drop a new video. No, I'm a get some game tuned in with super tight. Yeah, I get the low love from Big Bobo from the front seat, not no photos. 